I now arrived thanks to the gods through pathways rough and muddy a certain sign that making roads is no this people's study. Although I'm not always scripture crammed, I'm sure the Bible says that heedless sinners will be damned if they don't mend their ways. <laughs> <laughs> You know, he was a witty, witty guy, you know. <laughs> and he took a pot at people in, in his community who were... Uh, he took a pot at people in his community who he kind of didn't get along with. <laughs> and this is uh, one of the longer poems, uh, long, the longest poem I'll do. Uh, Holy Willie's Prayer. <laughs> now, Holy Willie was um, a guy who was high up in the church, and um, he got he got it. He was a bit dodgy, um, but he got it in his head that this guy Aitken was stealing the collection from for the church, and uh, but Aitken was actually saying, well, you know, if you can't afford to pay the church fee. Well, we'll leave it till next week, <laughs> don't worry. But this holy willy thought, well, wow, it can still eat from us. <laughs> and so they made a big fuss about it. Okay. Burns wrote this poem about it. O thou that in the heavens dost dwell, what as it pleases best thyself, sends ain to heaven, <laughs> And tend to hell all for thy glory. And no for any good or ill they've done afore thee. I bless and praise thy matchless might. When thousands that have left in night. That I am here afore thy sight. For gifts and grace. Shining, ample, and delight to all this place. O oh Lord, my God, that glib tongue aching, my very heart and flesh are quaking to think how we stood sweating, shaking, and pissed with dread while he, with hanging lip and snaking, held up his head. Lord, in thy day of vengeance, try him. Lord, visit him what did employ him. And pass not in thy mercy by him, nor hear thy prayer. But for the people's sake, destroy them and do us share. <laughs> but Lord, remember me and mine with mercies, temporal and divine, that I for grace and gear may shine excelled by men, and all oh, the glory shall be thine. <laughs> Amen. Amen. <laughs> that was a sort of a, an edited version of a long poem. <laughs> This is um, Burns wrote verse letters. And this is uh, from a verse letter he wrote to uh, Davy Siddle, who was also a poet. While winds fray off Ben Lomond blow. And bar the doors we drive in snow and hang us o'er the ingle. I set me down to pass the time and spin a verse or two in rhyme in hamely westland jingle. While well, frosty winds blow in the drift, bend to the chimney lug, I grudge a wee the great folks give, great folks gifts, 
that live, say, being snug. A tent less and want less their roomy fireside, but hanker and canker to see their cursed pride. <laughs> it's no in titles or in rank. It's no in wealth like London Bank to purchase peace and rest. It's no in making muckle mere. It's no in books, it's no in lear to make us truly blessed. If happiness has not her seat and in the centre of her breast, we may be wise or rich or great, but never can be blessed. Nay no treasures, nor pleasures, could keep us happy lying. The heart's eye, the part eye, that makes us right or wrong. him, Mochlin, husband's all. He often did assist you. For had you stayed hill weeks of war, your wives would ne'er have missed you. <laughs> <laughs> ye Mochlin bairns is on your press to school in bands together. Oh, tread you lightly on his grass. Perhaps he was your favour. <laughs> I'll do a few songs yeah. because yes. when when Burns yeah. Burns, you know, I looked at his book of poems <clears throat> and I the song section was so huge. Pockets. <laughs> 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 he, he wrote this song uh, after it published. He got a bit of success with the publication of his Kilmarnock edition of poems. He was planning to go to America, to Jamaica, um, and he tried this as a last gasp thing to publish the poems. Did it? It became successful. He went to Edinburgh. And he met this woman there, and uh, he wrote this song for her, because uh, the relationship was called Aphon Kiss. Aphon Kiss, and then we sever, Aphon Deep and heart wrung tears, I'll pledge thee. Warring sighs and groans, I'll wage thee. Who shall say that fortune grieves him while the star of hope she leaves him? Me. Na cheer for twinkle lights me, dark despair around me nights me. I'll ne'er blame my partial fancy, nothing could resist my Nancy, but to see her was to love her. Love but once and love forever. Had we never loved so blindly, had we never loved so kindly, 
never met or never parted. He had never been broken hearted. serve him but Satan's own crown. Thy fool's head, quoth Satan, that crown shall wear never. <laughs> I grant thou is wicked, but you're no quite so clever. <laughs> <laughs> Ha <laughs> 